Hello, and welcome to Short and Sweet, where I give you the lowdown on the best Broadway national tours coming to Chicago. I'm your host, Diana Martinez. If there is ever a show to expose your child to their first live theatrical experience, it is Cat in the Hat at the Broadway Playhouse. This show is a 40-minute quick show that's filled with physical humor, and it is bursting with creativity and comic bits, providing loads of laughs for young and old alike. One thing you should know is to take advantage of the pre-show activities and arrive a little bit early. It adds to the fun for your child. They have characters and ca coloring stations for the kids to interact with. This clever version of the show was an originally adapted at the National Theater in London, and it weaves in puppetry, poetry, puns and pranks, and pantomime that perfectly used the visualization for comedy and staging and engages the whole audience. The dialogue is really concise and it's carefully placed, really true to the classic Dr. Seuss rhymes, and the storyline veils a little bit of a theme of responsibility for your kids. The casting is perfectly done, and the actors truly couldn't be more true to their cartoon archetypes. First of all is Danny Taylor as the leading cat. He plays as part of the mischievous feline with a slick and frolicsome confidence. With his first entrance, he sets the tone for all the hijinks and madness. Eric Streberg stole the show for me as the fussy and flustered fastidious fish that desperately tries to manage all the madness. His comic timing is truly beyond excellent and he captures the audience with only his facial expressions and a puppet that he uses. He won over every kid and adult in the audience and they showed their appreciation and went up for grabs when he took his bow. Not to be overshadowed is Michael Richardson who plays the boy and Giselle Vaughn who plays little Sally who are both exactly how you'd envision the Dr. Seuss characters to be in human form. They are adorable and believable. After the show, the cat leads this awesome discussion with the audience that explains the theatricality of the show, and he shares a trick or two by leading the kids in a pantomime exercise to engage their imagination and humor and show them how they do what they do on stage. Emerald City, who are the creators of this show, truly know what they're doing and how to engage children, and they secretly weave in a lesson or two that captivates the kids. Don't let this summer pass without taking a trip to see this show. And since it's located right downtown and the show is short, you can take in a sight or two while you're there. Unfortunately, that's all the time I have today. If you're interested in being my guest for a show, just log on to www.broadwayinchicago.com and click on Short and Sweet, the icon for the show, and you can enter to win a chance for tickets to be one of my guests at an upcoming opening. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Diana Martinez, and I hope to see you at the theater or at the next episode of Short and Sweet. See you next time.